no greater f uh, fight than the fight for freedom. The fight for people to live as human beings in the land of their birth. There's no uh, greater love than the love not just of your own people, but you love people all over the world. And in, in turn, people from all over the world loved him. He loved people and they loved him. And he radiated gentleness. And he, he, he radiated that spirit of being very considerate. And he was simple, down to earth, and approachable. And everybody, especially the children, were his favorites and they, and they loved him. And so it is that we will continue to miss him, but we're happy to have known him. Please share one special moment that you've had with him that is most memorable in your mind. Anything at all? Well, we grew up under, under Madiba, uh, my family. My uh, father and Madiba were great friends. And um, Madiba's first wife was my aunt. So we are uh, family in a sense. And his children were our first cousins. They still are our cousins. And we uh, continue to be a close knit family. So I remember him as a father, um, very caring. I remember him later as a leader. I remember him as a freedom fighter. I remember him as a statesman. I remember him as president. And I was, oh, always knew that um, he was there for us, always like a father, always there for us. And I hope that wherever he goes, he'll continue to be there for us. I know that where he's going, he'll be met by Oliver Tambo and Walter Sisulu, Albertina Sisulu. And I'm sure they've prepared a special uh, reception uh, team for him for when he gets to heaven.